welcome back to my youtube channel in today's video i'm going to be doing a part two to some of my favorite dollar tree hacks that will have your house smelling amazing plus we're just going to be doing some deep cleaning and take you guys along with me while i clean my house because cleaning can just be so therapeutic so um yeah let's go ahead and get right into it I don't know about you guys, but anytime I clean, I need to start with the dishes because that's my least favorite part about cleaning is doing the dishes. So I unload the dishwasher, load that up, and get the dishes out of the way. So I like to take this nasty strainer um, after I wash the dishes and dump the food out and then let that soak along with my um, sponge holder just because it can like, you know, grow bacteria and we just don't want nothing stinking. So I let that soak in some bleach and dish soap. And now I'm going to scrub that sink down with some Dawn dish soap. You can never go wrong with Dawn dish soap. It's my favorite cleaning uh, product. I'm going to wipe the counters down with a regular sponge um, just to get the crumbs off first. And after I wipe down the counters, I like to go back in with some spick and span. And this is from the Dollar Tree. It's my favorite like antibacterial um, disinfectant cleaning spray. And it works wonderful. I use it on all different types of services from the countertops to the um actual like cabinet doors walls and everything i love this product and you can get it from the dollar tree look i even put my daughter to work because most of these marks on my cabinet and stuff is from her and her little feet when um she's sitting at the island so have your children help you clean up because they think it's really fun and it also you know helps you as well Moving on to the first hack that I use to keep your house smelling amazing is this Arm & Hammer baking soda deodorizing powder from the Dollar Tree. I love this stuff and this scent is my favorite one. Um, I use this on the carpet upstairs and also on this rug underneath my table because some sometimes my dogs will sit under the table and you know we ain't trying to smell dogs when we eating our food so i like to use that i let it sit for like 30 minutes before vacuuming it vacuuming it up and it smells so so good i love it moving on to hack number two so my trash can is in desperate need of being washed and this is just something that I've put off for a while. So we're going to go ahead and clean this trash can and I'm going to show you how to keep your trash from smelling. So let's go ahead and wash this up and once I get it all clean and it's dry and everything, here are the products that I got from the Dollar Tree and I absolutely love this hack because you just stick this right on the side of the trash can and it just absorbs any smell and um it just smells amazing it says it lasts for 60 days so i have to let you guys know if that's true and yeah this is a super easy hack to keep your trash can from smelling so we're bringing back hack number three um from the last video 
please go watch part one if you want to see other um, hacks to keep your house smelling amazing but I do this every time I clean I just combine a bunch of different fabuloso scents I use lemon orange and pine in this one and I also use bleach and I fill the mop bucket up with some hot water so it all mixes together well and mop the floor it never fails me it smells amazing and I love this hack So I think that we're on hack number four. We're going to be using these oils to make a homemade fabric freshener. I just use a old Febreze bottle and I pour the oils in the bottle with some distilled water. That's distilled water. I poured it from another jug and some witch hazel. Mix it all together and it creates a fabric spray that smells amazing. It's not too overpowering. It's perfect to spray on your curtains and your couch and stuff like that. I love my subscribers because they be coming with the best hacks. Somebody left me a comment and let me know that you can take these scent refills and pour them straight into your warmer. And this is a game changer. It smells amazing. It just fills up the house instantly. And I love this hack. I also tested out Dollar Tree's plug-in diffusers with their scent refills and they don't smell um the smell isn't as powerful as your glade and airwick so just keep that in mind you can smell it but it doesn't fill the room as much as the um other brands so that brings us to the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, leave me some comments down below with your suggestions and your hacks because I've been loving them. They actually work really well. And also, if you could give this video a thumbs up, I would really appreciate it. And don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.